Welcome to Unit 5, Jobs, los trabajos. We are on Students Book, page 41, exercise 1. Look at this, we have a musician, a doctor, a firefighter, a chef, a footballer, a nurse, a bus driver, and a pilot. Okay, what's the meaning of musician? Músico o música. Una persona que es músico o música que practica la música, ¿verdad? What's the meaning of chef? Un chef, un cocinero. What's the meaning of footballer? Un futbolista, ¿verdad? What's the meaning of nurse? Enfermera o enfermero. What's the meaning of bus driver? Conductor de autobús o conductora de autobús. What's the meaning of firefighter? Bombera o bombero. What's the meaning of pilot? Un piloto o una piloto, ¿verdad? Piloto de avión. Ok, so, now, listen, point and repeat. Ok, we are going to listen. Vamos a escuchar estas palabras. And with your finger, you have to point the correct picture, ¿ok? Tenemos que indicar con nuestro dedo la imagen correcta, según lo que nos digan, y después repetimos, ¿vale? Musician Doctor Chef Firefighter Footballer Pilot Bus driver Nurse Activity book, page 29, exercise 1. Look and write. Mira y escribe. Ok, we have a vocabulary box on the top of the page. Tenemos una caja box una caja de vocabulario on the top, encima del todo, ¿verdad? We have bus driver, chef, doctor, firefighter, footballer, musician, nurse, and pilot. So now you have to write, ¿ok? For example, up on the left, arriba a la izquierda, we have a boy with a trumpet. Tenemos un chico con una trompeta. No? So, what is it? Is it a bus driver? Es un conductor de autobús? Mm -mm, no. What is it? Okay. So now guess, adivina, guess which job is each person. Adivina qué trabajo tiene cada persona. Okay, students book page 42. Listen and Number, we are going to listen, for example, my dad is a doctor, mi padre es un doctor, so maybe it's number one, ok, tenemos que poner el número, en el orden en el que aparezca, nos va a decir, number one, this is my dad or this is my mom, este es mi padre o esta es mi madre, and they are going to say the job of their dad or their mom. Yes, so you have to put number one, two, three, four, five, or six. Depende del número que sea. ¿De acuerdo? Ponemos el número. One. Hello, everyone. This is my dad. He's a doctor. Two. Hello, girls and boys. This is my mum. She's a footballer. Go! Three. Hi, this is my dad. He's a firefighter. Four. Hello, this is my mum. She's a musician. Five. Look, everyone, this is my dad. He's a chef. 
Mmm, thanks, Dad. This is delicious. Six. Hi, this is my mum. She's a pilot. Activity book page 30, exercise 2. Look, read and match. Mira, lee y une. Ok, so first of all, primero de todo, we have to look, tenemos que mirar. We have half pictures here, tenemos mitades de dibujos, ¿verdad? So we have to match them, ok? And then we have to match these two pictures with the correct sentence. Tenemos que unir estas dos partes de imagen con su frase. Look at the sentences we have. He is a doctor. Él es un doctor. She is a footballer. Ella es una futbolista. He is a musician. Él es un músico. She is a chef. Ella es una chef. So, come on. Vamos allá. Exercise number three. Look and circle. Okay? It depends if it's a boy or it's a girl. Si es un chico, boy o una chica, girl. So, if it's a boy, we use he. Si es un chico, sabéis que usamos he, él. Y si es una chica, usamos she, ella. ¿De acuerdo? So, he's a nurse or she's a a nurse, it's number one. Ese sería el número uno, ¿no? We have to decide. Tenemos que decidir. Between he or she. Él o ella. Look at the picture. Mira la imagen para comprobarlo. Ok, Students Book, page number 43, exercise 5. Listen and sing. We are going to listen. Vamos a escuchar y después cantar. Okay, number six, play a game. Okay, we are going to go one by one. Vamos a ir de uno en uno diciendo las profesiones, ¿de acuerdo? For example, number two, she's a... Hmm, ¿Qué es? Tenemos que decir la frase completa, ¿de acuerdo? She's a... In this case, en este caso, firefighter. Una bombera. Then we are going to say the number. Number three, he's a... And we say the job, decimos... El trabajo, el oficio, ¿de acuerdo? A ver cómo de rápido sois para llegar a la número 12. Activity book, page 31, exercise 4. Look and write. Ok, we have four jobs here. Tenemos cuatro profesiones. But these jobs... Mm, 
these jobs are not in order. No están en orden, ¿verdad? Las palabras. So, you have to unscramble the words. Tenemos que reordenarlas, ¿sí? So, you have some keys. ¿eh? Tenéis algunas pistas. In the picture, ¿ok? Tenemos unas pistas en los dibujos, ¿de acuerdo? So, when you guess the job, cuando adivines el trabajo, write the name of the job below. Vamos a escribir el nombre de la profesión debajo, ¿de acuerdo? Number five, look and complete. Ok, we have to choose between his or she's. Ok, él es, he is, él es, or she's, ella es, she is. Ok, so look at the pictures. It depends if it's a boy or it's a girl. ¿no? Depende de si es un chico o una chica. Vamos allá. Un abrazo.